drawing two grand finals. Yeah, no, he, uh, I feel like the changes they made to Robin didn't really alter the gameplay that much. All they did was kind of fix some of our tools. Like, Arcfire actually connects now, and it allows him to follow up really consistently. But we're going to have to see how he fares against this grand finals team in Double Pit, or Pit Dark Pit, oh, Freakazoid no. and Tavi. So, picking some music. Looks like we're probably going to go to Pokemon Stadium 2. I don't know if uh, they're calling brackets for singles yet. <laughs> like they probably come in here. They probably come in here to ask. Okay, that's fair. I I hope so. Just... Yeah, I know. <laughs> like both you and I are on the mic. We can't hear anything but game audio through the headphones. Oh, and ourselves. Yeah. Uh. Maybe we aren't going Poké Stadium 2. We might actually be seeing some other stage. I can't quite tell yet. But they're hovering Battlefield, obviously. I wouldn't be surprised if PS2 is where we went, though, as we've been seeing it a ton in these matches. A lot of, yeah. Like, like every game almost. And yep, yeah, it looks Poké like we will be going 2. to Pokémon Stadium 2. Oh, man. Pit and Dark Pit. Versus Robin, Robin and okay. Donkey Kong. All right, looks like we're gonna get straight into it here. Grand Finals of teams. This, we're. I think regardless, we're gonna be taking for a ride. Yeah. I I kind of want to see how the pits try and edge guard DK with his armor because they can't just kind of forward air him. No. And they can't really nair him as much, but they might go for more spikes. Like, oh, like they that. could, yeah. Yeah, that's like uh, Freakazoid was actually trying to do just there. But in neutral, they're, they're going to have to try and contest Robin's projectile. I think this is... Well, I was, I was going to say, I think this can be actually really good for Try Hard Train and KTE. Because Donkey Kong can be really good with getting around, getting around Pit. Especially when Donkey Kong gets a grab, uh, like one grab to up throw to like up air, that's like you could just be gone. Yeah, and unlike the, uh, unlike some of the matches we've seen before where they were to kill the pits, they needed to edge guard them. Donkey Kong just has that straight kill power with neutral B, back air, up smash, but you can't really use them if you're dead, die into the side B right there. And then. Freakazoid dying to bronze back air. Oh man, this is all right. Looking more like in Tavi and Freakazoid's favor already. Here comes Try Hard Chain with the back air. Relatively Ooh. even game speaking. Same stock, similar percent. Good combo games from both teams actually. Oh, oh, Tavi eating that back air, dying for it. KTE barely getting back on the stage there. All right, grab, up throw, up air. I mean, obviously doesn't kill, but he got that for percentage rate. Right? Still does quite a bit of percent. Now, he, instead of the ding dong, he can just kind of throw you. It's more consistent now. Just cargo throw, jump off, throw you even closer to the last zone. Donkey Kong led to 150 though. Oh, almost, almost good DI. Really KT getting back on there really clutchfully. Looks like the pits are both trying to kind of back off and just shoot arrows, but I don't know if that's the correct option. Armoring through Arcfire, actually, really smart option off the ledge to get past Robin's ledge pressure, but I really want to see the DK dying soon, otherwise, they might have an issue. Living the yeah. 200, oh, there we go. There's Bounce your back. wish. Robin trying to edge guard Pit with back air, but no success. Oh, that's all spike in the DK. Does he no, Magnahan manages to get back on? I actually thought KTE was done there for a second. Whoa! Killing Pit with Thoron. That, we're gonna probably see that a lot more in this game than the last. Probably. 
Although, the pits do have reflectors, so it might be a little scary to throw out now. Oh no, Up I don't. B's off stage, SD. Oh. At least. He was at kill percent. That's unfortunate all the rest. Oh, oh no, you, I mean, you, you, you don't want to see something like that you go accidental off the uh, yeah, no, off of the stage. Tough. Especially and, when no one's there. And his, yeah, his partner was too far away to save him, so it's really unfortunate that's the... Oh. Hi, yeah. Pit. Oh my gosh, he was at 20 and almost died. Oh my goodness. Oh, out of Elwyn. He can actually just toss Rob high, but DK's just gonna guard him. Until he got Elwyn back, yeah. Here comes Tri-Char Train. Nah, I don't think there's much that Freakazoid can really do here. I think that's it. Oh. Oh no. Well, still two to one. This is a lot more possible now. Oh, fishing for the grab there. He can kill DK. He might be able to contest Robin. Maybe reflect a stray Thoron. That's it. Oh, yep. that's it. That Trier Train going really hard off stage to get that pit. That was really, really good there by Trier Train. Yeah, no, that was really smart. All right, try hard train KTE taking game one. They have to, if they win this first set, they go into another set. <laughs> Tired? A little. I am a little bit too, actually. I, I just need to get up and stretch. I thought that the tournament was gonna start at like five, like usual, but. No one told me it was going to start at like 2. I think this is a special, uh, a bigger one. Is, it is. Is this the because first Ultimate Crepes? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I've been going to basically every weekly I could this week. I went to BTT, went to Smashfield, and now I'm here. I was actually debating whether I should come here or not because it, it is an hour away from me. But Oh, really? Yeah. Everything's an hour away from me. Literally everything. Here we go. That's Final okay. Destination. I like this pit pick because now Donkey Kong and Robin won't get those platform extensions with back air and forward air. And yep. the pits can still edge guard them just fine. There's no high option really for them to recover. And now they can do dare and nair without worrying about landing lag with air. I will say it's probably going to be harder to get around DK though. They can't just kind of jump over them. No, they can't because. DK will catch you if you try to jump around. Ooh. Really crazy arrow coming from Tavi, almost catching him from around the bend. This is really cool. KTE trying to go in uh, over uh, Freakazoid. It's hard getting like around it. Or throw coming for Tavi. Almost gets the arrow to connect. Armors through the the donkey kick, the donkey punch with side B. Right. Super armor coming into play. Donkey but. punch charged up. He's probably not gonna use it yet. Alright, I'll throw Ding up there. Got some good damage with that. I feel like the pits should probably try and contest closer more because they, they have good normals. Obviously, Donkey Kong is kind of scary to contest, but... Oh, yes. Without a doubt. Maybe getting a grab and throwing him off. I, I kind of want to... I want to see him focusing DK. I want to see him throwing that DK off stage, and then I want them to cover... I want to see them covering his options because he has to... He has a really good year recovery. Also. So if they just kind of throw him off and spike him... Should just, be gone. should just be gone. It'd be a better, it'd be like a better setup. But instead, they just keep throwing one of them off stage and then trying to contest with the other one. I feel like they should go for more edge guards like they were in previous games. Maybe they're trying to keep it safe. Maybe, because they, they do keep dying off stage when they try and go off stage. But that was, that one was mostly because of a, a poorly timed arrow. 
good F smash punish on the Oh no, we're about to shift to his teammate, but that was a good F smash punish on the laggy upbeat that Donkey Kong had. That was a good reflection there from Tavi as well. Now they're just kind of side being haphazardly. I don't know if I like that coming from them. The down, uh, the down throw into fair from Tavi. Oh my. Oh, nice back air there. Good side B. Try you can't really contest the side B with any of Donkey Kong's normal super armor on so it's a good option instead of dropping low and maybe Ouch. Playing. Oh my gosh, the Levin Sword. Does and we're at Levin even sword, stocks. Right? Well, no. we were. But it looks like this is a 2v1 situation here. Uh, <coughs> 2v1s are scary. Oh like, my gosh. Not oh trying to sound like Captain Obvious here or anything, but. Oof. Oh, that was a good double. Oh, that might be dead. I think so. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dead. He was too far underneath the flat, uh, the stage. No matter how, like, if you try to angle up B as pit, you can still get stuck. So, try hard training, KTE up 2 0. Up 2 0. Yeah. We might have a reset. I have a feeling that they're probably going to. Reset the bracket, but from there it's kind of a toss up because that gives them so much time to learn from their mistakes if we do end up getting it. I mean, they oh, could, that's true. They could reverse 3 0 and to avoid the, the upset, the reset, but I don't know about that. I, I thought you were going to say upset for a second. Like, is it an upset? No, uh, but talking of upsets, talking of upsets, the Pits did beat Daybreak and Ori to get here. So yes, that was one upset. Here we go into game number three on Pokemon Stadium. So it looks like a, I, I mean, I really hope this is gonna go well for both Rikazoi and Tavi because they've done vulnerably well on this stage. Like when we've seen them it versus like, uh, like other teams, uh, double pit for Pokemon Stadium can be good. Like really, really good. Yeah, no, it's definitely. I think the stage, honestly, is probably the most neutral stage in the game. Uh, I don't see anybody that really benefits like a ton. And if the if Tavi and Frigazoid have the confidence to contest them on stage, I think the stage is perfectly fine. But right now, blue team just has the stage control. Dryer train trying to edge the Oh my god, oh. super smart trump by Freakazoid. Dryer train misses the edge guard and gets killed for it. God, that scream there from Pit. <laughs> Ooh, nice job by Tryhard Train there with the what was that Arc Fire? I believe so. What? I believe so. Yeah. Arc Fire with with Robin is, it's hard. It's hard to dodge it. Once yeah, you get no, stuck in it, you're just paralyzed. Yeah, now it actually connects, and you can get imagination it, off of it. It does big damage too. Yeah. Oh my gosh, this ladder of the DK, almost super clean, but Tryhard Train says no. I'm gonna kill you for trying this. Welcome to my train. You're by my rules. All right, back here from. Oh, KTE. Donkey Kong's off stage. He's just kinda... He manages right, to get back on and good shielding, too. And he gets the grab, too. So much damage, like 30 damage from that Ding Dong. Again, no 1v1 multipliers. That's a good chunk. A down throw to an up air from Tavi. Ooh. Breaks the orbiters with Donkey Punch. Oh, good recovery there by Try Hard Train. That was... That was kind of clutch. Nair on shield looking like it's safe, but try our train at least the next option going for it. Uh, right now it looks like Donkey Kong's just kind of holding center stage, but Pit take it back, back from him. And they Oof. end up killing try our train, and now they're in the lead. And Donkey oh, Kong hit dies to the arrows. Oh my gosh, that was such a nice string. He hit. He got hit by like four arrows in a row. Yeah, no, and he died for it. That was so. That was really cool. I've never actually seen that. Me neither, actually. Me neither. Wouldn't, wouldn't have even been possible in uh, 4. 
Oh, all right. Playing the edge guard game here against Tryhard Train. His team kind of, his teammate kind of covering his uh, edge options. But oh my gosh, gets spiked by Elwin. That was kind of gross. And now it's even stocks again. All right. And now, oh, here comes Tryhard Train. Because we're just kind of getting trained off the stage. I mean, okay, I like the fact that uh, Try Hard Train's like going out there, like trying to intercept, but there's a big risk with that. Yeah, no, the pits are a dangerous foe to try and get cast off stage, but if you have a giant Levin sword that kills, it's not a terrible idea. Especially with that nice stringy end. Oh, yes. Still looking relatively even. Oh, almost Donkey Punk punches uh, Freakazoid. Oh, does Try Hard Train have a jump? Oh my gosh, he just arrowed him again? Oh, no, that's his arrows stock. coming in from Freakazoid. Oh, he's gonna do back throw? Oh, oh. That, that almost worked. That almost comboed. But armor, black, grab armor. I feel like F throw at ledge might kill. Oh, this is. They oh, miss that's again. Dangerous. Yeah, oh, that that's, works. that's it. Next time, I if they end up with that situation again, if they get a grab, I, I want to see them do maybe F smash instead. Because up smash is a, has a weird like dead zone under underneath it. Oh, it, yes. it doesn't reach very far under, like it doesn't reach very low. It's kind of high above pit. Right. So if it, it kept whipping like in a weird way there, maybe F smash would make better. And it's also less hits, so it's a little bit more consistent. Right. That's. That's a good point you brought up there. Here we go, game number four. I, I, I don't know what game. Uh, I don't know what stage it was on. Oh. All right, so we're going Unova. I. I think this is another neutral stage. This might just come down to preference. Um, Probably. But. It also makes it so that the pits can't just short hop Nair to pressure the platform. Nope. They have to, like, they, they still hit through the platform, but they're bigger platforms, so they won't cover as much. Oh, Nair to Nair to back air. That was a really clean conversion. That Good combo setups. Good combo setups by Freakazone and Tavi. Ouch. Alright, just kind of playing each other out here a little bit. Try hard, try just kind of throwing out a bunch of swings with a sword. Bunch of aerials. Oh! Good sword smash. smash. Lasting path to air dodge. You almost made me on. Oh. I did. Ah. Alright. Blue team was being controlled. Donkey Kong getting a donkey punch on Tommy. Ending that stock. Punch through the face. Up, up throw up air. Trier Train securing another kill with forward air. This is looking mighty grim. Oh my. Oh my okay. God. I almost did that. That would have been crazy. Yeah, if Trier Train would have like SDI that, like fully, that would have been a really good recovery. I actually think they weakened SDI in this game. I don't think it's nearly as prevalent. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, I mean. You can't really SDI on most gems anymore. They're just kind of stuck. They're just kind of stuck in them. Oh, is it just regular DI? Well, SDI might still exist, but I don't. I don't know if it's any good anymore. As that might be one, why Hardfire works so well now. You can't just SDI out of it. It might still exist. I just. I could be crazy. Oh, good, clean forward throw. Saying, no, nah, you're not gonna just sit there and charge Donkey Punch while I'm right here. Both pits uh -oh. off the left side though, that's dangerous. Both of the pits. Watchfully getting making it back on. Alright, back here from KTE. Yeah, KTE like doing a really good job. Keep it Tommy off the stage, but ooh. Almost kills with cargo forward draw. That almost like, killed. I feel like he could have killed if he just waited a little bit longer on the forward throw. Ouch, man, this is like, this is a nail biter. I think, uh, I think it looks like the double pits are, sorry, I think the double pits are spicing it up a little bit more. 
Like, they're going in, and they're also they're also making it faster. They're not taking their time. Yeah, I get it. But that, yeah, that's a very dead pit. That's a really cool punish that Tryhard Train's been doing on uh, Legend Vitz ability, or just two frames. He's been L-winding to catch, to catch them and spike them and kill them super early. It's working really well. Oh, but they finally secure that kill on Donkey Kong. It's even stocks. Similar percent, too. This is basically an even game. There's those grab combos that we keep seeing from Donkey Kong racking up that nice percent. Oh, but clean conversion from the pit secured a really early kill on Tryhard Train, and now it's 2v1 on Donkey Kong. Which pit do you get through? Like, which pit do you get through first? Oh man! If KTE wants to make this, he's got to really, he's got to really watch out. He can't jump over pit too much, because they'll catch you with the crab. Up air. Yeah, that's that be that's it. death. I oh, think. No, wait, no, it's heavy. not. It's heavy. Yeah, it's no, heavy. that's death. All right. Now it's a game five situation. They they brought oh it back. Oh my gosh. If they win, they win the tournament with the pits. They do. They win this next game. They have Tryhard Train and KTE win that. It's they reset. reset with Racket. This was what I wanted, a game five situation. Yeah, I didn't think they could pull it off, but I've been proven wrong. Me neither, man. But like, it looked like they, uh, it looked like Freakazoid and Tave were really hanging in there, like from game four. Like, they just knew what they were doing. <laughs> <coughs> like, they knew what they were doing. They were, they were helping, they were helping each other out, too. And it looks like we're going back. Back to you. All right. So immediately, KTE. I don't know if I like this pick. The, the more room that this stage has over Poke Stadium 2, Seems to be benefiting the pits because they just kind of get to carry them along with theirs and fairs for longer, and doing more damage, and they can still edge guard. Oh yes, yeah, that's that is a, that is a thing. Ooh, I, I like the up smash and jump there from KTE, but did not didn't well, connect. Nice team, simple team combo from the pits on Donkey Kong there, almost uh, spiking him a second time, maybe putting him in a dangerous position. Oh, that four throw off of the stage here. I thought that was going to kill. Trying to follow up on his teammate almost, it seemed like. Oh, off that hit in air. Jeez, man, that's... This is going to be rough, man. Like, game five scenario... Oh. One of okay. the pits finally lose their stocks. And KTE e and Chew smack uh, clean tech from uh, from Tryhard Train. That's how <laughs> that's how Tryhard Train does it, man. Yeah. Saving his, his stock several times over. His Robin is something else. Oh yeah, no. That's crazy. Oh, okay. Here comes Tryhard Train, but good DI. Ooh, we saw some parries. Freakazoid almost following up off of uh, Triar Train's accidental jab on his teammate. And then Tavi securing that kill on Triar Train himself. Electroshocking a bad uh, recovery on the stage. Uh, kind of slowing the game down a bit. Oh, never mind. That forward throw coming in from Freakazoid. Securing that kill on Donkey Kong. And now it's even stocks, but percentages are far from it. Back it up. Oh, back throw there from KTE. Oh, no. That was way too, that was way too low there. Tavi. Tavi with the fortunate SD. I feel like we're going to be seeing a lot of those since this is a newer game and the mechanics are slightly different, slightly different buffer. 
gonna make I believe that. Yeah, make their recoveries a bit different. Oh my gosh, very what? interesting option with the up B from Donkey Kong. Did you see that combo conversion? Up B into forward air. Oh, okay. Freak is only making up for his partner's FD by living to an astronomically high percent. Uh oh. Oh, I thought I thought Tryhard Drain didn't have enough jumps. Yeah, one Ooh, nice fair. Yeah, the fair should kill. Right, so this is a little bit in blue team's advantage here. Oh, still very doable by uh, red team. A few edge guards. Oh man, this is. Robin does have Thoron charge, so he needs. To be and he uses it right say, there. Yep. That does take out the stock, and we're on a 2v1 situation here. Looking rough for Freakazoid. Try hard training. KTE one stock away from resetting the bracket here against Freakazoid and Tavi. Can they do it? All right, charging up the arc fire. Down air. Eating 11 for his trouble. Ooh, that should be and it. And that is Nair. it. Nair we have him. ourselves a bracket reset. Wow. A game five reset? Oh man, this is gonna... This is gonna be, be a crazy. long one, I can tell.